What is up, you guys? It is your boy, the Bonkai to the motherfucking Tensho here. And today we're going to be live reacting to the new episode of Atelier Ryza. Um, honestly, I think I'm, I'm think I'm going to start just uploading live reactions for Ryza on Sunday. I know the new episodes usually drop uh, Saturday. Yeah, they usually drop Saturday, I think. But, you know, usually since I have to, like, edit and then, like, get, like, some certain things onto the video and shit and get it uploaded at a certain time, then, you know, it's mainly just going to be uploaded on Sundays. But without further ado, let's get it. Let's start this. So let's start it over. ライザたちの様子がおかしくて。こんなに作ったのに、なんか品質が気に入らないな。ちゃんと作ってるはずなんだけど。I just noticed Claudia is watching on the other side. Ah! <laughs> I noticed that too. <笑>でも。こんな風にみんな張り切りすぎてて心配で。この前いろいろと焚き付けたからな。肩に力が入りすぎているのだろう。なんとかならないでしょうか。うん。余計な力を抜けばいいのだろう。私に考えがある。<
So my boy Lent is buff as fuck, though. I figured, man, because he's strong as hell. And Tao, I mean, Tao was there, bro. Technically swim and everything like that, but I didn't think like anime-wise they actually add that. Then again, a little bit of the anime should probably not be canon to the game, to the franchise itself. So I'm not sure. ライザ。Goes off on adventures all the time, Lenton Town, so she should be able to like swim and shit, you know, like. Look at Tao, bro. He's such a pussy. <laughs> oh, man. Oh yeah, so this is this is what I was talking about mainly. So this is what happened. This is why Ryza was afraid of water a bit. This is one of the few reasons why. This is actually this is actually the backstory, the backstory between Ryza, Lent, Kao, and also um Boss. Boss is the bully basically. The thing about Boss is that he's like a bully and shit. Now, nowadays, well, technically, he's not really a bully. I can fix on my quick. The thing about um, the thing about boss is that he's actually like an edge lord bully right now. If you think about it for a sec, because back then, back then he was friends with Rise of Lent and Tao. But then what happened? And if you played through the game, you should already know. You play the first Atelier Rise, you should already know what happened. Basically, Ryza was drowning. Lent and Tao tried to pull Ryza out, but the water was like pulling her back and shit like that. And like I said, this was when Boss was friends with them, but Boss ended up ditching them. I think from what Boss explained, I think Boss went to get help or something like that. I don't even know. But then to Ryza and them, it just looked like he ditched them. And ever since then, they've the three of them had been distanced from Boss and they were no longer friends with them. So then Boss ends up just treating them like a piece of shit and stuff and just making fun of them and stuff so you know they weren't on equal terms with each other to, they weren't on equal terms with each other anymore after that um but pretty much after everything that happened here with Ryza drowning and everything Lent and Tao trying to save Ryza you know they just they, the three of them just weren't on terms with boss anymore and you know at that point they just weren't friends but later on later on boss is gonna be cool with them 
they're all going to be friends again and stuff like that. But for now, as it stands, they're not on equal footing with each other on a, on a friendly footing with each other. So that's why Ryza is like a little bit of afraid of water because of the fact that she was drowning back then when Lent and Tao and her were actually young. So that's Lent and Tao trying to pull her out. <clears throat> やったみたいだな。うん。よそ見をするな。水中部に飛び、百回追加。え。水にも慣れたようだな。アップストレートアップデップ。水にも慣れたようだな。アップストレートアップデップ。水にも慣れたようだな。アップストレートアップデップ。
ってこともうん。<laughs> <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think it's safe. So that's why Epo was missing. That's why he was missing. That's why he dipped. <laughs> yeah, I don't think Epo would actually be in there. Like, hell no, bro. He would not go in there on his own free will. わたしが合格だと思ったら次の試練の場所を教えよう。素材これはライザに任せるしかないか。みんなもそれっぽいもの見つけたら教えて。素材素材と。あ、青爪草とランタンソーだ。ラッキー。You know the one like the two that can actually relate to each other a bit on research and everything is definitely Tao and Empu. Now that I think about it. But this is this is also good for Claudia to, you know, spend time with Ryza, Lent, and Tao too. That's the hideout they're gonna make too. アオツメクサにランタンソウ、海に組ネの実か。それにこいつは稲妻港だ。こんなものまで見つけたのか。これ稲妻港って言うんだ。雷の力を帯びている石だ。覚えておくといい。はい。合格だ。やった。次の試練
しかしこのままなんとなく追いかけても無駄な気がする。みんなで協力しないと。協力？力を合わせてリラさんを追い込むの。作戦を立てよう。まだか。日が暮れるぞ。はい、今行きます。よし、これで行こう。みんなでリラさんを
Make a hideout. Mm -hmm. A secret hideout. There you go. Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Yeah. So next episode is them gonna is them making the hideout. They're gonna take. They're gonna fix up that building. They're gonna fix up that fucked up building and then make a hideout just like that. But. I think that's it for today's other than that you guys that is actually riser episode five i'll see you guys in the next episode i'm gone